Good morning, cuties. I am so happy to report that I'm feeling a lot better. I'm definitely not 100%, but this is like the best day that I've had since being sick with this cold, so I'm very happy to report that. We are about to kick off the work day. I'm gonna work from home, and I am also very grateful for myself that I got myself a coffee yesterday. I got a venti at Starbucks, and I put some in the fridge for myself. So this is an Americano Misto with a couple of pumps of pumpkin sauce. Every time I say pumpkin sauce, I'm like, it sounds so weird, but that's what it's called. It's not called like pumpkin spice syrup. It's called pumpkin sauce in the Starbucks app. Um, anyways, I'm gonna heat this up and enjoy it and start working. Okay, so I've got my coffee and I need to phone a doctor's office to try and book a meet and greet. And I've been putting this off because I definitely have phone anxiety and this doctor situation is making me very nervous. So basically I knew that I needed to get a new doctor. I put out, it's hard to find a family doctor right now in Calgary or like everywhere, but I put out like a poll on Instagram and I got a bunch of responses of people saying that their doctors were accepting new patients. So a couple weeks ago I sent out a bunch of emails and I heard back from like five of them. So then I put off phoning them for like two weeks because I was like, oh, there's like five options. But now I really do need to phone them so I can book something. So I'm actually gonna do it with y'all with me <laughs> because I'm scared, but let's just do it together. I basically just need to book a meet and greet and like I could book multiples. I'm gonna try and just like book one, you know? I have my first choice that I'm gonna try and phone, so oh, let's just do it together. Hi there, um, I'm phoning because I sent over an email to see if you were accepting new patients um, and I got a response back letting me know just to give you a call um, to potentially book a meet and greet. Yeah, sure. So, do you uh, do you ready your uh, health card? Um, yeah, let me just grab it for How you. Many patients? Uh, just one, just myself. Uh, sure. Yeah, if you could please, uh, I need your health card so I can register you. Sure. Okay. Just give me one second. Sorry, I should have had that ready. I'll be one minute. Okay, so it's been a good day, but it's been kind of a chaotic day. I also was just trying to leave the house to go to my facial, and my nose started bleeding, so it was just chaos, and I'm really nervous that it's gonna bleed more, so I have some tissues, but, like, are you kidding me? <laughs> So I'm gonna go and get my facial. I'm honestly so excited. I'm so excited to check out this clinic. I'm going to YYC Skin Guru, and I swear like everyone I know goes there, and I'm, I've heard amazing things. So I can't wait to go, and I'm getting an IPL, which is a photo facial, which is gonna target the sun damage on my face, and I have like a ton of freckles but also a ton of sun damage. Like, I don't know which ones I was like born with and which ones are sun damage, but I know that I have a lot of sun damage, so I cannot wait. We're doing a hydrabrasion facial, which I think is just like clearing out all the gunk, and then we're gonna do an IPL, so I'm so excited. I'll take you along, and I'll also take you along with the recovery process, because I think there's minimal downtime, but some stuff is gonna happen. So I had a craving for Pillsbury cookies that I just could not shake. So I went to Shoppers, but they didn't have them. So now I'm going to Safeway. And I was saying to Mac, they're like, I just need to have treats on hand so that every night I'm not like, oh, I need a treat. And then I need to go out. <laughs> so I'm going to get a couple things of cookies to have on hand, you know? It is 9.49, I've been working from home a little bit, but I am gonna head into the office. I'm just gonna have a little breakfast and then put on some makeup and go. My facial last night was really good. It was such a lovely experience. And then 
the IPL did hurt a little bit. It was like, just kind of like rubber bands snapping on my face, but uh, I have a little bit of redness and some of my dark spots have gotten darker, you can see here. But it's because those are about to fall off. So we love that for me. So it was great. Definitely a busy one today, just getting everything sorted before going away. But I've decided that even though it's a busy day, it's gonna be a good day. My Nespresso pods are on their way, which is lovely, but I think I have to leave the house before they come. So I'm gonna have to get one last coffee out. Sorry. Okay, I'm just about to head out and I got this new sweater from H&M. I was heavily influenced by a girl on TikTok and I bought it in this cream color and also in like a gray color. And I got it in a large because I wanted it oversized. I thought it was gonna be a bit longer. Like, I don't know if I got the right one that the girl was wearing because hers was like a bit longer. Um, but this is what she looks like. She's cute, she's cozy, she was pretty cheap. So, I'm gonna wear that today. Exciting day. We're gonna be on the news. We are shooting some social clips for Unafford, which is this cool campaign. And we just showed up to do some social clips, but surprise, we're gonna be on the news. I think I wear my fancy sweatsuits. They said those girls look like stars. <laughs> no, they look like regular people. Oh, what a day. It's like 7 p.m. I just got home and yeah, it was just kind of a chaotic day. I also got a nosebleed during a call. So that was not fun. <laughs> um, and then after work, we went and like shot some video social content for Unafford, which I mentioned, I think in the previous vlog where we're helping out with this campaign and it's about like the rising cost of goods and the rising cost of living and how like everyday items shouldn't be luxury goods, like shouldn't be out of reach for people. Anyways, so we went and we got some social clips but then it was fun because we got to be extras on the news and we also got to be like interviewed for like a case study from this the other agency daughter that is doing this activation. So it was actually really fun. Um, but yeah, just got home, so Mac and I are gonna eat some dinner. I have some work that I have to finish up before going to Banff tomorrow, and then I have to finish packing, so still a little chaotic, but that's what you get when you have like a two-day work week, basically, so considering the chaos, I'm doing well. Um, my face is doing okay. I have like a couple of breakouts that I feel like just sprouted up today, which I'm just like, can you not? And then I feel like some of my freckles are definitely like darkening. So we'll see how that plays out. I definitely need to wash my hair tonight as well. So lots going on, lots going on, but we're feeling good. Just gotta get through tonight, like get prepared. And then we're off to Banff at like 8.30 tomorrow. So, and I'll bring y'all to Banff because it will be action packed, I'm sure. So yeah, it was a good day. It was a busy day, but that's life. All right, friends, it's a little chaotic in here. Uh, my nose was bleeding again when I got into the shower. So I was in the shower for like 40 minutes with a nosebleed. Don't wanna talk about it. And I worked a little bit more. It's like 9.30. Um, I'm currently sorting through my work bag. It's chaos in here. Like, tell me why I've got Benadryl, Tide to Go, Huggies, Mac was like, why do you have Huggies? It's because when I'm traveling and I wanna like wash my hands or like wipe my hands, but I don't want like wet ones with like all that alcohol. I want like fragrance, fragrance free Huggies. Anyways, I gotta sort that situation out. And then 
I washed my hair, obviously, so that's good. I'll do it in the morning. I do have my bag pretty much packed, and that's my outfit for tomorrow. I, I can't point at that. <laughs> um, and then I'm feeling pretty good. So once I sort through my work bag, I'll be good. And then um, I also, I mean, I'm gonna have a little snack. Mac bought some chips. So I'm gonna have some chips. And then last night when I went and, bought, when I went and got cookies, I got like two things of it and I was gonna like individually wrap them and freeze them, but I'm kind of too lazy to do that. So I may try and do that when I get home because I'm pretty sure they'll be fine in the fridge for like a while, but I'm probably gonna eat some cookie dough. So my snack is gonna be cookie dough and chips. And I'm gonna read my book a little bit because I need to wind down because I am very wound up. Probably be up early just to finish packing but yeah, I'm like surprised I got everything done. When I was in the shower and my nose was bleeding, I was like, fuck my life. I was like, this is so chaotic. I was like, this is just too much. And I was like, is my body trying to tell me something? Is my body trying to tell me to slow down? Anyways, we'll figure that one out later. Good morning. I'm sitting on my floor, just about to take some medicine and then do my makeup because Mac is in the shower. I'm feeling pretty good considering, like I had a pretty good sleep even though I woke up early, but I feel prepared for, I was gonna say the weekend, but it is the week, still the week, but um, yeah, my, Coworker's gonna come pick me up. We're gonna stop at Starbucks, of course. We were like joking yesterday that it's like, if we're going on a road trip, like please assume that we're stopping at Starbucks. So yeah, I have a half an hour to do my makeup and then to finish up a little bit of work before they pick me up and then we'll be off to Banff. Okay, I'm ready with 20 minutes to spare. All set to go. It's a Christmas miracle. I'm wearing this sweater, which is the exact same sweater as I wore yesterday. Also the exact same pants, but this is the other color of the sweater. Yeah, it's like definitely not bad for the price, although the sweater I wore yesterday I did find a hole in it. And I like didn't even wear it. Like I put it on and it had a hole in it. But I think you get what you pay for, you know? So I'm just gonna do a little bit of work while I wait to get picked up, and then we'll go. Room tour. Okay, I did not do this earlier, but it's a very cute room. And we've got, it's so dark, but I wanted to do it. The bathroom's also really, really nice. So, she'll do. She will do. Okay, so it's almost bedtime. It is 
just before 10 and as you can tell I'm losing my voice. I think it's just because I've been talking so much today like I don't feel that tired but um, <clears throat> anyways it was a good day it was like honestly really fun and pretty jam-packed and I'm just getting myself organized gotta get my phone charger it's a really nice hotel I'm happy that we're staying here again we stayed here last year and I hope that we get time to go to the hot tub because they have a really nice hot tub on the roof. Okay, phone charger. I'm trying to get to bed so that I can get a really good sleep. And tomorrow, I think we're gonna meet in the lobby at 8.30. So honestly, not too early of a morning. I think it should be good, but we're pretty full on for the next two days. So yeah, just like wanna get into bed. I got a caramel in my swag bag. So I'm gonna have a couple pieces of that. I have some content to edit and then sleep time. Oh my gosh, it looks like another gloomy day. I did not prepare for rain at all. Oh my. Um, had a great sleep, honestly. It is like 7.45. I'm just gonna make myself a little Nespresso, which should be good. And I'm meeting everyone in the lobby at 8.30 to go to the conference. So I have a bit of time to get ready and to prepare for the day. I love these little cups, a little bit of cream. I don't know yet what I want to wear. I was thinking about it last night and like we have two full conference days. So I had like a plan for like one outfit but now I'm realizing that I need two. <laughs> So we'll see. I just like want to look good but be comfy because I'm going to be, it's going to be a long day. Um, we are, I think I mentioned this, but the gathering, we're here to like attend it, but we're also working with them. So we're getting content and so we're pretty full on, but it's been really fun so far. And I'm just really excited about the rest of the time. I hope my voice improves. Um, I feel like pretty good, but my voice is still a little iffy okay so here's the stitch i need to be out in this weather for like one second then i'm gonna be in the bounce springs all day so i don't want to bring a jacket i'm thinking of wearing this <clears throat> sweater again that i've been wearing pretty much the entire time <laughs> let me show you what i've got so this is what i have on brown bodysuit zara jeans zara I think that it gets pretty hot with all the people around. So I kind of want to wear this like over my shoulder or like tied around my neck kind of thing. But to get there, I'm going to wear it like just on, but no other jacket because I don't want to be carrying around a jacket. So I hope that's going to be okay. I have six minutes before I have to be in the lobby. I'm just finishing up my makeup. So we've got to, we've got to get a move on here, Mel. Okay, I am gonna wear these heeled booties to elevate the look a little bit. And they're really comfy to walk in actually. These were like probably one of my best purchases, also from Zara, no surprise. But I get a lot of compliments on them and like they're just like classic but also kind of trendy. And they just, they just really work. Okay, so. This is what we're working with. Again, I'm probably gonna take off the sweater, but for now, this is what we've got. Got my bag. I had my computer in it yesterday, but I pretty much can do everything I need to for my phone, so. Little conference look. 
I think it's cute. I feel like the jeans, like I'm a pretty casual gal, so I feel like the jeans take it down, you know? And it does, it's doing what it needs to do. It's not like, it's not iconic, but it's, it's something. And I have clothes on, and now I have to go meet the team in two minutes. Let's go. Okay, change of plans. <laughs> Our shuttle actually doesn't start until like 11, so we may, we have to like see if we can, um, get on like the city bus but if not we're gonna be walking up to the castle which is like a 25 minute walk so I'm going to have to wear different boots so I can't slay the day today and this promise this promise of generative human energy is not only what I do but it's why most brands I talk to most boards I talk to are like can I get one of those? Like We're going to Hello Sunshine. Hi vlog. Hi vloggy vlog. It's me. We're nice. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we're going to Hello Sunshine. It's so good there. And we're going into like a little karaoke room. So yeah. what's so, your karaoke song? Get ready. It depends on my mood. Like, do I want to do a ballad? Do I want to rap? You could probably do multiples. True. I'm just nervous. I know, I'm nervous too. But it's like an intimate group, so I'm fine. True. Like, I'm better with like a group of this size. But than, I like, need some more courage. Some more liquid courage. Yeah, really Even though we've had two marks, and they were delish. Yeah. I feel like it, the effects has worn off. I know. I was really feeling them before, but now not so much. Yeah. After all of the work. But the marks stuff. were... <laughs> The work sobered me up. Yeah. <laughs> it's been busy, but now it's time to play. It's day three of the conference and it's been so fun so far. It is 9.30, just getting the day going. I'm just like in this random beautiful little room because I'm gonna do a voiceover for my TikTok vlog. Got my Starbucks in hand. We've been like working while conferencing, which has been a lot. But we've also done like a lot of fun stuff. Like last night we went to Hello Sunshine and we did karaoke and we also went to Lupo and tonight we have the gala. So we're gonna be like dressing up all nice. And it's just been like really fun. And like just having a great time with my team and I'm still a bit sick and I also got woken up with a nosebleed this morning, but it's still been a great time. So I'm gonna do this voiceover quickly and then gotta get back over the conference and we have another full day, so. It blew up. And we're like, all right, there's something here. And I think we started developing that strategy and all of that a little bit backwards. And we saw like, okay, that worked. And we didn't we didn't think about it so much to the, to the point where we were like prohibitive of what we could do. And then we kind of backtracked and started creating a strategy off of that. The stewards, it continued to reinforce the newly diverse world of the brand. Okay, day three, we're almost coming to a close. Um, it is like 6 p.m. We just went for a drink at the hotel bar and unfortunately my nail actually two of my nails have like Broken so I'm just gonna go to the pharmacy to grab like nail clippers or like a nail file Then I have to rush back to the hotel get ready for the gala Which is gonna be really nice um, we're gonna like have a dinner and That's like the wrap-up of the conference. So it's gonna be great. Hi cuties. Oh my goodness, just got back to the hotel room and I'm so tired and quite honestly a little bit drunk. I'm just like tipsy. I had like three drinks, but anyways, 
it was a really good night dinner was great the awards were great it was going on a bit long and like at 10 they did like an intermission and we were like this is our cue to leave <laughs> so we left and we took a cab back instead of taking the bus um and now i'm probably gonna have a shower and put on some tv and i'm just feeling really grateful for like a really great experience here and also excited for a sleep and excited to go home we're gonna hit the road pretty early tomorrow because mckenna has somewhere that she has to be so we're gonna go and get breakfast tomorrow morning we're gonna meet at eight and then we'll hit the road and we'll get home and i'm very excited to go home and to see mac but it was like just really fun and a great i just felt really comfortable and like we went to this last year and it was awesome but this feel this year just felt like even better and i don't exactly know why that is but it just like felt that way so yeah um i'm gonna yeah have a shower get into my pjs get all comfy probably eat some chips <laughs> i have like a ton of chips that were in our swag bags so i've got cheetos ketchup twix and caramel but i'm feeling pretty like savory snacky right now so i'll probably eat like both of these and maybe take that one home good morning just made myself a little coffee it is 7.34, meeting in the lobby at 8, so I've got to pack up. Okay, so today we're literally just going to breakfast and then driving home, so I'm not going to do any like makeup or anything, I don't think. My skin has been pretty good. I did have like one very large breakout here, but it looks like my IPL is doing what it needs to do because some of my um, like dark spots look like, people said that it was going to look like coffee grounds, which like it does. So hopefully those fall off soon, but I will say it's like a little bit smaller of freckles than I thought. I thought that some of like my bigger ones were gonna like fall off, but I guess that's not really how it works. Or you'll have to get like multiple treatments for that to happen. But yeah, my skin's been like honestly decent. So I'm just gonna do some like moisturizer, some sunscreen, and probably some glowy stuff. I think I have like five minutes before I have to be all packed and in the lobby. That's been like the theme of this trip is literally rushing everywhere. Also, our hotel is like in town and the Springs is obviously like up there. So getting places has been just an ordeal. Okay. Sunscreen, I tried this, Sunscreen Neutrogena Ultra Sheer, and it was on sale at Shoppers for like $20, and it's really good, I like it. It's like a serum, so it's very lightweight, no white cast. Okay, then we're gonna do some of this. Halo Glow Elf, so good. And this provides like a little bit of coverage. And then I'll probably brush my brows and then that's it. Maybe put some of this on. Oh, I hear them. <laughs> I hear them being ready like rolling their suitcases out of their rooms. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. Yeah, 
That's it, that's all we're doing. Mad dash. Okay, my makeup. Finish my coffee. Okay, I've got two minutes till I have to be in the lobby. Um, I'm gonna wear my Uggs because I feel like that's a comfy road trip vibe and I'm wearing my effortless pants. So, let me show you. Road trip fit. Okay, no, I really, really gotta go. Okay, I gotta sit on it to close it. <laughs> Okay, I'm four minutes late, but we're ready to go.